Hello Stock Fox family, I'm Stock Fox and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be discussing Riot Blockchain. But before we do that, I just want to say thank you to all of my subscribers out there who have helped me and supported me along my YouTube journey. For those of you who are tuning in for the first time, please like and subscribe to my channel and also consider becoming a Patreon member. For those of you who just want to give general support, you can do so by sending me a super thanks down below. Now, let's get into Riot Blockchain. Who exactly is Riot Blockchain? Well, let's take a look here. I'm on their website now. It says Riot Blockchain is focused on supporting the Bitcoin ecosystem uh, through proof of work mining. It says we are believers in Bitcoin and our efforts are aimed at growing our mining operations, which demonstrates our commitment to the Bitcoin network. Riot is one of the largest U.S. based publicly traded Bitcoin miners in North America, and we are consistently working to improve our efficiency and production. Let's take a look here. Why Riot, Riot Blockchain? If you are a believer in cryptocurrency, such as Bitcoin and Ethereum, like I am, then there must be someone who has to mine these particular coins, okay? So they don't just, Bitcoin and Ethereum doesn't just pop up. There are companies out there that actually mines the coins. Riot Blockchain is one of them. Now, I have purchased Riot Blockchain in the past, in, where I basically swing traded it. Uh, it, it made some pretty decent money off of it. Now, Riot Blockchain, like many of the other cryptocurrencies out there, have fallen on hard times. And when I say fallen on hard times, what I mean by that is, is, is that they're down. And I mean the cryptocurrency across the board is down. So if you own cryptocurrency right now, you're probably, uh, I mean, unless you bought in at way, way earlier stages, uh, then you're probably either, you know, in the hole or you're certainly, you're certainly losing money. Let's take a look at this one right here. So as we look at Riot Blockchain right now, we can see that it, it closed as a business on May the 13th, which was Friday, uh, at $7.97. Now, you can see here that on November the 12th, Riot Blockchain was trading at $44.19. That wasn't that long ago. Now, if we take a look at the, at the stock and watch it travel down uh, uh, to this point, the stock is down some 37% uh, at, at this time. So it's 37% uh, off, it's, uh, off of its one-year high. Okay, so let's, let's look at it from that particular standpoint. I believe that this particular stock has hit a low. You notice that I didn't use the word that it hit a bottom. None of us can actually call the bottom in a stock. I'm not able to do it, and I don't know too many other people who can. How we protect ourselves is usually by dollar cost averaging into a stock. So I have recently gotten back into this play again at the, uh, around the $7.20 level. Uh, that's my cost basis on it right now. Now, if you've watched any of my videos in the past, you're going to know that I'm the type of person who tells you that you need a entry point and you also need an exit strategy, okay? Um, now, my entry point was $7.20. I would have liked to have gotten it when uh, basically it hit its lows right here at $6, uh, down at $6.84. I was really monitoring it that day to try to determine was that a good place, a good starting point to get into the stock. Okay, well, unfortunately for me, the stock basically started to rise on me. I went ahead and got in around the $7.20 level. I'm up on the play right now. That being said, uh, Stock Fox family, I'm not for sure if it's sustainable or not. So I use the words dollar cost average is because don't go all into this particular play right now. I don't think that uh, it's, you know, I don't think that, that the good times are just ready to start rolling. I still believe that we're in a, a bear market. I still believe that there is a lot of um, tough sledding ahead for us uh, in the stock market. But I do believe that this is a good entry point uh, right now to leg into this particular play. That being said, however, I'm in at around $7.20. I still believe that $7.97 is a good starting point right now if you want to get into this stock. Now, as I usually tell uh, all, of, uh, all of you, 
Uh, anything I say is not a suggestion for you to buy, sell, hold, or trade any type of cryptocurrency or stock for that matter, okay? Um, what we do here is pure entertainment. I bring to you plays that I've made money with in the past and uh, opportunities that I see, uh, uh, opportunities here where I can continue to make money going forward. So this is, a, uh, this is one of those opportunities that I think we get to buy into a miner or uh, a mining company uh, and play uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum uh, from another angle. Now, when I say that you must have an entry point and an exit strategy, as I always do, I don't subscribe to the theory that, um, that when a stock starts to tumble on you, well, uh, I don't know, maybe you've heard the old, uh, the old adage, uh, if you like it at seven, you must love it at five. Well, I, I don't subscribe to that, and I don't like it at five. Okay, so when I say that you must have an exit strategy, my exit strategy is probably to bail on this stock if it drops below $6.50. Well, you're probably saying, well, well, aren't you going to lose money? If the stock retraces back down to $6.84, I will continue dollar cost averaging. I would try to get it at a much lower, uh, uh, I would try to get my cost basis down at least under seven. But if the stock continues to retrace and the stock continues to fall, right we don't want to just um we don't want to we don't want to be holding a falling knife in a situation where we should have let something go uh, you know uh, you know prior to basically it hitting rock bottom i'm not saying that about this particular play but the marketplace is where it is right now and you have to be careful uh when you um when you're basically playing with your hard-earned money okay so that's coming from the heart right now because i, I want everybody who, who uh, subscribes to my channel and who watches me to know that we're here to win. We're here to make money. And sometimes making money is not losing it, okay? Uh, so so you got to know when to basically say win in these situations. So that's how I'm going to be looking at it and that's how I'm going to be playing it. That's not to say that if you buy in now, the stock starts to retrace, um, that you shouldn't continue to buy now because I'm certainly going to be buying more of the stock. Now, I won't chase it up. What does that mean? That means that the shares that I own right now, um, I'm gonna be okay with it uh, where it sits right now. So if this stock takes off and goes to nine or goes to 10, I won't be I won't be dollar cost averaging up in this particular play. Okay, so I've gotten in where I'm at. I'm pretty good with the amount of shares that I hold right here. That's not to say that sometime down the road I may not you know I, I may decide to pick up more shares. But right now uh, this is a this is an investment play that I'm looking at right now uh, into into this particular play. Now let's get to the why. Why is it that I'm looking at riot right now at this particular time. Well, let's take a look here. We can take a look here and we'll see here uh, that Riot Blockchain reports a record first quarter uh, 2022 uh, financial results. Uh, so let's take a look and let's see exactly how well they did, all right? Now it says Riot reported a record 79.8 million in total revenue and produced 1,405 Bitcoin produced in Q1 2022. Okay, so that's a lot of Bitcoin produced in during that quarter. It says Riot uh, Blockchain, an industry leader in Bitcoin mining and hosting, reported financial results for three months uh, for a three-month period ending March 31st of this year. Now it says here, it says we are extremely proud of the progress that Riot continues to make, having achieved record levels of net income. Uh, 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 I'm sorry, in revenue uh, reported by its hash rate and Bitcoin mined in the first quarter. Now, let's take a look here. I don't want to read all of that. Let's go down here. It says, Riot continues to obtain significant milestones while positioning itself for future opportunities. It says the increased total revenue, they increased total revenue by some 244% to a record 79.8 million, as I stated before. Now, they've also increased mining revenue by 150% to a record 57.9% uh, and produced record net income to 35.6 million. So you begin to, get, uh, to see the theme here. They just reported record-breaking uh, numbers here. And the stock has fallen on hard times 
as I've just shown, uh, shown the graph to you, where the stock is basically plummeted all the way down uh, to $7.97 and uh, as low as $6.84 uh, as of recent. So I believe that this is a real good time to take a look at this particular play. Let's see what some of the analysts are saying about this. Tip ranks basically right now are saying that this particular stock is a strong, a strong buy. They have the highest price target at $50 a share. They have the average price target at $38.50. They have a lowest price target at $29. Okay, Neil, you know how I feel about analysts uh, and that they can afford to get it wrong and we can't. All right, so you take that with a grain of salt. But I do think that this particular stock is at a low. Again, I didn't say a bottom, but I do believe that it's trading at a uh, at a low for where it is right now. And I do think it's valued at a whole lot more uh, than what uh, than the um, than the eight dollars that is currently trading at right now. Again, you do your own homework and due diligence to make the determination for you what you feel uh, is uh, is best for you with this particular play. When I look over here, uh, Barron's also uh, shows uh, this particular stock as a as a uh, buy rating as well uh, with this particular play. So we have a, uh, so we certainly have the analysts on board here showing that this uh, particular company is a buy. The question is is, is that it, is this a good fit for you? Uh, how do you feel about Riot Blockchain? Do you feel like this is a, a play for you? Do you feel like this is uh, an opportunity for you to get in at the ground level uh, and maybe um, and maybe ride this stock back to its all-time highs as an investor? Again, um, as I've stated in previous videos, you always have the opportunity to either day trade a stock like this, swing trade, or become an investor. I don't have a desire to day trade it, swing trade it. So uh, the shares that I own right now, I will be owning them as an investor. Now, that being said, when I say I own something as an investor, if I wake up uh, a week from now and the stock is trading at $20 a share, more than likely I'm probably going to sell my shares, okay, at that time. I have to be truthfully honest with you in regards to how I see things when I get into a play like this right here. But I do believe that there's real opportunity to make some money right now. And uh, again, that's why we're all here. Uh, so let me know what your thoughts are about Riot Blockchain. Do you feel Riot Blockchain is a um, is the, is the type of company that you can get behind? And if it is, leave me a comment down below. If you feel that uh, now, or if you actually own this company already, I certainly would like to know uh, if you own it and where do you own it at? Are you are you profitable with this stock? Uh, you know, did you get in uh, too high and you're trying to find an exit strategy to get out of it? Uh, I'd like to hear your thoughts on that as well. Well, I hope you got something uh, out of this particular video, Stock Fox family. And, uh, and if you did, please leave uh, me a like, in, uh, a like down below and a comment. And uh, please, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Well, that's all I have for you today, and I'll see you in the next video.